uh, constantly is broadening this whole idea of terrorism. Mm, yeah, definitely. Um, so, so people around about you who don't understand, who, who think uh, that the news is real and everything they get told is real, mm. they've never questioned their education, uh, they've never studied for themselves, they've, they've, they, they've, been, they've been fed all that they know, mm. those people are dangerous to those around that, that understand mm. what's going on. Hmm. And 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 they're really basically decent people deep down. Mm. It's just that they're they're already under mind control, mm. and they don't know it. You know, um, do you think that the, the, the in a, in a way that it's it's ra- rather brutal to say that the that the people in that sense are are soulless because I I don't think that's you know possible in that sense maybe. But but do you think that there is um, You know, is there an, a, a, you know, uh, the spirit of, of of some people seem to be, you know, strong. Uh, the spirit seem to be stronger in some people than in in others. Do you think that yeah. this particular is is there a particular class of people that actually uh, kind of like, uh, you know, or uh, or are more inclined to uh, go into a system that is about all of that control into the hive, uh, and the yeah. true rebel, you know, with the true spirit actually is the one who is only resisting it. But that's not enough to go around, so to speak. Yeah. Uh, see, we do have, in our world, we do have, and I've granted this, this many times, this odd phenomena mm. called uh, the psychopath. Mm, yeah. Psychopathic personality. And it isn't just at the top strata of society. You have it all through society. Mm, mm. And perhaps the problem today is isn't that, that there are too few people controlling the majority of good people. Maybe the good people are already in the minority, mm. white, yeah. all through society. Hmm. Uh, if you walk and listen to the values the people espouse, it's all concrete thinking, what they've bought, what they want, what they're going to do. Mm. It's egotistical. They're, they've already emulated the, what they admire, and that's the elite, the ones who have power. Mm. Yeah, of course. They copy their speech, they copy their dress, their fashion. Mm. They want to get up there, or they love to get up there. And a psychopath, you see, worships the more powerful person, the person above them. Mm-hmm. It's the only one they'll respect, is the one with more power above them. In fact, they're in awe of the person and their superior, who is superior. We saw that with, uh, with, with the, the communist uh, upper elite mm-hmm. military system, mm-hmm. and we see it in the Nazi system too. Hmm. The ones below admire the guy above and would grovel almost and salivate at the thought of having that power that the person above them has. Now, the public, unfortunately, are doing the same thing. Mm. Uh, they're emulating the Donald Trumps, so or they want to. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Everyone who's famous and rich and wealthy, regardless of how they got it, yeah. is admired and, and, and people bow to them and, and uh, curtsy and all this stuff. Mm. Uh, we see this on much entertainment every day, you know, the, the stars. Mm. Uh, the people are showing you their gods. Yeah, that's right. They're showing you what they worship. Mm. So I mean, uh, do you think it's is a misinterpretation from from in this instance from our point of view that we believe that we thought that the human race in that sense actually was something more? But but if we actually were to look at it, uh, maybe maybe that is what the human race is and was and, and so forth. But it's. Uh, Uh, you know, we who are the, you know, the uh, divergent factor in the, <laughs> in the human experiment. Yeah, and that's why I always say I'm not. I would not try to save this system. Yeah, which is artificial, beyond perversion. Hmm. It's corrupt from hmm. top to bottom. Yeah. In fact, we all have to be forced into it, and be corrupt to survive. Hmm. Hmm. Because it's a it's a scaled system of dog-eat-dog from the worst ones at the top down to the bottom. Mm. And we're all forced to participate because they've given us no other way out. That's right. Closed all the old loopholes. You can't go off into the country, uh, put up an old shack somewhere and live your days out because (laughs) uh, a man with a tape measure from the government is going to measure it and demand taxes. Yeah, that's right. You must get money to pay him. If you get money... You've got to go out and, and work in the exploitation business yeah. or be exploited yourself or that's work for someone that's exploiting someone else by what you make. Yeah. You know, a vast profit, which is extortion. 
uh, every, the whole system is based on a form of extortion. That's right. And, and, um, and do you think and, and that... And yet most people, as you know, would, would probably, as I say, if you could show them any other way, mm. uh, they would rather opt for that which they know. Hmm. Do you, do you think that they have... Um, because in a sense, I mean, if, if, if you were to look at nature, I, I don't see it... I don't see the nature as as a brutal, you know, force, but but the reality of it is, is that you know there's always a, a bigger fish, you know, the 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 bigger fish eat the smaller ones and so forth. I mean, it's it's rampant in that sense in nature. It's it's about one species, you know, actually, you know, thriving on another. Uh, do you think that that is what has been emulated within the artificial human system that they've looked upon nature and said? Uh, Okay, in order they, for this in fact, to... All through the writings, they always, the elite always talked about the laws of nature. Mm -hmm. Now they, they just use the word science, which for the same thing, that's the same thing for them. Mm -hmm. However, what they never talk about is the fact that being humans, we always have the temptation to do the wrong thing, but mm -hmm. we have the choice to do the right thing. Mm -hmm. Animals and insects don't. So we're not mm. animals, you see. We're not insects. Yeah, that's 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 right. I definitely. We have choices. I agree. You know, you can't uh, you can't blame a bear for for uh, coming up and killing your cat outside your house. Mm, yeah. Uh, because it it will want to eat the cat, you see. Mm -hmm. And there's no point in persuading him either. Yeah. Uh, but with humans, <laughs> we have the choice of what we want to do. Yeah. And it's always easy to do the wrong thing than to do the right thing. Mm. It's an odd phenomena. It is. However, mm. uh, the old story is um, there's that collection agency in a sense. The more wrongs you do, they'll catch up with you eventually. <laughs> you can't get away with it. And the world really has got an accumulation of choosing the wrong things. Mm. Uh, but we're about due for uh, a comeuppance. Yeah, the, and, that's uh, seems to be. And yet we always do know what the right thing is. We mm. don't know. <laughs> now, the only person you could say is not human on the planet, again, is a psychopath. Because if you define human as someone, a fully human, who is, it's nothing to do with intellect. Yeah. It's nothing to do with education or living standard. It's to do with empathy for other people. Mm -hmm. The mm -hmm. psychopath does not have it at mm -hmm. all. Mm -hmm. They're like a separate species. Mm -hmm. And because of that, uh, they, ha they have no quabbles about doing what we would judge as being wrong. Yeah. They don't have guilt. They have no guilt whatsoever um, about anything that, which they do. Hmm. So we have a different type amongst us, but too many today, I think. And um, we're allowing them to guide us. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. what they're going to do is to stamp out our ability, our uniqueness, mm -hmm. Above all the animals, the insects, and everything else, they want to stamp out our ability to have consciousness, to make conscious decisions of right and wrong. Mm. You've decided they're going to do it all for us. Mm. And so there will be no individual path. Um, and and there'll, be no, there'll be no ability to even seek anything beyond yourself, yeah. for yourself. And and this is, this is in a way, the, the battle of our times. I mean, if we, if yep. again, if we look at history, there have been <laughs> you know, numerous amounts of, uh, you know, tyrannies roaming around. And, and, and in all ages, it seems like there is a different battle to be, b to be fought. And, and in this one, it is just as we, we have been talking about here today. And that seems to be the kind of our battle in, in that it sense. Battle. Yeah. See, you don't find this in what... And I always used to wonder why an elite... And all sciences, too, are taught this, to, to teach the students of zoology um, and ethnology and so on, mm. to teach them this. And they call them primitive peoples. Mm -hmm. Anyone who is, and again, they call it stagnant or arrested civilizations. Mm -hmm. yeah. People who are quite happy with the tools they have, the, the lifestyle that they have, they have, they're not interested in, in going any further. Yeah. But we call them primitive or arrested civilizations. Mm -hmm. and, and the elite really hate them. They really hate them, hmm. because those people are, it's almost like showing them a, an alternative system. Yeah, exactly. To their own. A more natural one, you know. And, and uh, they have no problems with psychopaths, because they don't have any armies, hmm. standing armies, or military, or police. Hmm. If a deviant were to come along, or, or pop up, they would dispose of that deviant. Hmm. 
because the psychopath, if he's allowed to carry on, will seek power. Mm. Every psychiatric book on the planet admits the psychopath does more damage to those around them than to themselves mm. yeah. because they feel no guilt, sorrow, or pain or anything else. Mm. But they crave power and power over others. Mm. And our system, which is called money, reward, punishment, etc., mm. and accumulation, is built from its inception in money and a commercial psychopathic system where the rich live, the poor die, the old story. Mm -hmm. uh, that's not a humane system. It's actually a psychopathic system. The reason being that pathocracies always end up giving you a culture which is based on their belief system. Mm -hmm. we, 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 we go along with it because all that we know, if you're born into it, mm -hmm. but we wouldn't go as far, hopefully, as to um, kill the person next to you to get the promotion. Mm 